couple of tips specifically for phone recording. The first one is put it into airplane mode. Um, because if you put it into airline mode, uh, then you won't have phone calls in the middle of your video recording, which will obviously ruin a take. Another is uh, you, your phone probably has a front and a back camera. And usually the camera that faces towards you is lower quality. And what that means is, is that you'll have a quality drop in your image if you if you're using it the easy way. The easy way would be to set it up so that you are looking at the camera and you can see um, the image of exactly what the phone's recording, but there's a quality drop. It's better to set it up and uh, record so you can't see the image, uh, which is a little tougher to work with, but you get better quality. Now reflectors don't just work as a, uh, when you, to balance out a now reflectors don't just work for balancing out a light, a hard light from above. Uh, what you have here is, is I'm sitting here um, and now all we have is the ambient light from the outside, from the windows which are over to the side over there. And it's not a bad light, it's quite a soft, gentle light. It's probably not as strong as I would like, I prefer a little bit more light to help the camera work at its best. But uh, adding a reflector here can just have a, a help a, to add a little bit of little bit of class. So here's this silver car windshield reflector, and if I just put that up beside me like that, that should just add a little bit of side fill, a little bit of uh, style to the whole process. It's kind of obvious with. Uh, DSLRs and with cameras that you need to keep the lens clean and people tend to take care of their expensive equipment and they keep the lens clean. To keep the, to, to clean the lens um, properly speaking you should start with a, a little puffer blower um, which you can buy from a camera shop. Failing that a soft brush is useful. As a last resort you might resort to using a soft cloth to clean the lens if there's stubborn dirt. But people don't tend to think about cleaning the lenses in their phones because it's almost like you don't realize that there is a lens in your phone but there is a lens in your phone and it's very small and because it's small it's more susceptible to collecting dirt which can degrade the quality of the image and for that matter um, because it's because it's a, a it's a phone it tends to live in your pocket and it's more exposed to dirt uh, anyway so uh, taking a moment to check that the lens is clean and uh, using a soft brush to blow any dust away is a, a really good step. 